What a time to be alive. <laughs> Listen, every single thing that you have been through has prepared you for the season. You are the type of person, the fact that you clicked on this video, you are the type of person that probably has gone through a lot. Like I'm seeing this image of like, you know, when you're walking through mud, there's just been a lot happening and it's been tough. It's been a tough season. There's been a lot of heaviness in this journey that you have been walking and experiencing and it has felt like you probably may have been left behind or you've been you've been traveling slower than the rest of the people that are around you or your peers or your family but it, it just feels like there's the season of um sl like it's slow it's slow right and heavy slowness and heaviness that you might have been experiencing and that season is coming to an end okay um you're entering a season where you are becoming a winner you are finally getting the things that you have been working for or working towards and this season is a season of open doors doors that have been shut I find the opening for you doors you know you know i'm i'm seeing this image of like heavy bolted doors you know like doors at a bank vault they have you have to close them like with a wheel because there are so many bolts in the door to lock it those heavy doors that have been closed are finally opening up for you this is a season where um, there's a lightness in the air. It's almost like fresh air is entering into your life because those heavy doors are finally being opened and light is, is shining into your life. This is a season of lightness for you. This is a season of, you know, th that self-discipline that you've accumulated, that, that, that faith that you have had is, is bearing fruit. You know, when they say you shall reap what you sow, you have been sowing. And this is a season of reaping. But understand that, yes, the season of reaping does not mean that the self-discipline needs to stop. It does not mean that the education needs to stop. It doesn't mean that, you know, this desire to always become a better person needs to stop. These are things that should continue in your journey, but the heaviness is turning into lightness. And I love the word light because, because it's an image of lightness as in lightness, but also, you know, when I was saying that, like, it felt like you were walking through mud, that heaviness is also becoming lighter. Your steps are going to quicken. And this is a season of favor. This is a season of like, um, your energy field is, 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 it has expanded. You know, that this thing of aura, they say aura is this, this energy field that is around us and your aura can contract or expand relating to depending on not relating to depending on you know how clean your diet is and certain things that you do and it feels like this season is a season where your aura your impact is expanding and it is expanding <laughs> in a way that is bigger and brighter than what you've seen before this is really a winning season for you the fact that you opened this video is confirmation that you're entering your winning season it is confirmation that you are stepping into those ideas or or that path that you've been working towards and for some reason in the past it was a bit tough to <laughs> to do that thing it just felt like it wasn't the right time you understand but this season is the right time that that heaviness that feeling of you being delayed is about to go away because this is the season it's like trying to grow a plant in winter okay it's not going to happen the seed is going to be in the ground and it's going to wait for for spring or for the warmer months it, it feels like that it feels like you know this past season was a season of 
solitude, winter for you. And though you were planting seeds, they were not going to spring because seeds, or well, certain seeds, I'm not a seed expert, but we all know like, you can't plant the seed in the ground and then it's covered with snow and then expect it to grow, you know? The seed needs warmth, it needs the light, that kind of vibe. It feels like seeds were being planted, but they were covered with snow. So it was tough for them to spring forth. But now we are in a place where it's a spring, it's a summer, the snow has melted, the seeds are in the crown, that snow has nourished. That thing that was heavy on the seeds, right? It is nourishing the seeds now because the ice has turned into water and it's nourishing the seeds and all of those heavy things that you went through, all of those heavy experiences that you went through un is nourishing the seeds. So the things that you went through that were difficult and heavy, were, it, it's actually a good thing that you went through them. They prepared you for this time. They are the accelerant for this time. So everything that you have been through has prepared you for this moment. And your seeds are going to bloom. Your seeds are blooming. Your seeds are, you know, <laughs> they're sprouting. They are coming out for air. Because you have done the work. You have prepared for such a time as this. And your seeds, because they've been incubated for so long, when they spring out, they're going to spring out like... <laughs> like they're going to come out strong. They're going to come out beautiful, blossoming, right? And even though your seeds are blooming, you still need to take care of them. Okay, you still need to take care of the things that are blooming. This is this just because they're blooming, and yes, it's fantastic. Celebrate, but don't forget to water your, your plants once in a while. You know, don't forget to prune your plants once in a while. So, that self discipline that you have cultivated in that season, it shouldn't just because now you're in a winning season, it doesn't mean that now you need to slack. Okay, that self discipline is something that you need to carry from the season to from that season to the season right because if your your flower are blooming your flower is blooming excuse me but you don't water it all of that stuff that you went through it's going to be for nothing and we don't want that in this time so the things that you wanted the things that you felt in your heart that are supposed to be yours this is the season that you're getting them and it's time to celebrate the, those tough seasons they're out the window. <laughs> this is the season for you to celebrate. This is the season where your, your goals are coming into fruition. You have favor in your life. This is that time. This is that time, undeniably so. This is that time for you, period, period. But we need to understand that we still have a responsibility in this season to maintain that win, to maintain that energy, to maintain that bliss and, and celebrate. Celebrate this person that you've become because that snow, that snow, that, those heavy things that you were going through have made you a better person. You have, you have grown some resolve. You have grown some, you know, you have grown, man. <laughs> and this is a season for you to thrive and enjoy it. Enjoy it. Enjoy this new season because you've been prepared for the season and you were not going to be able to handle this season had it come any earlier. You are going to squander it. You are, you are not going to be able to keep it because those things that those habits or lessons about yourself that you learned before now, you are not going to you not when you are not going to be able to hold and handle the season if it weren't for those lessons. So be grateful for that snow because it's nurturing your seeds right now. Be grateful that your journey was delayed. Be grateful for the fact that your journey was slowed down and that you are finally blooming in your season. You don't want to be the rose that blooms in winter, okay? You are blooming in the correct season and be grateful for that. Be grateful for that. 
And the fact that you watched this video, I'm so happy for you. I feel like gratitude should be your song every single day. And I wish you all the best in your journey. And uh, yeah, man, this is, this is your time. This is your time to, to do all those things and to be that person that you've always wanted to be. You already are. It's just that it was under a layer of snow and the snow has melted and now it's nourishing your seeds and you're blooming in your correct season. This is your time for you to win. And I'm so happy for you. And, you know, may this life journey of yours continue being, being beautiful. And, um, yeah, man, I'm happy for you. And tell me how, tell me, after you watch this video in the comments, tell me what happened. Because I would love to know what happened. And, uh, yeah, this is a beautiful life that we live. And I just want to thank you for watching my video. <laughs>